Okay, so the issue that we're troubleshooting right now is a situation with the title block where the when we have multiple revisions for a given sheet, the information in the revision schedule disappears. So I've got three different revisions in this particular project and we're just going to quickly create three different revision clouds each associated with the other revisions. So I'll go ahead and do this one right here. We'll, uh, we'll tag it right now and let's just move that to revision one just to kind of keep things in order. So it populates okay, right? That looks good. But as soon as we add another revision that's associated with a different, because right now this is the same revision, as soon as I go ahead and move that over to revision two, you know, it's not there, and the same would happen, I suppose, if we did a third one, but we don't need that. So that's the problem. The solution is actually pretty easy. It's like any other schedule. If there's no sorting or grouping defined, then Revit says, well, there's multiple values being displayed. I can't display any uh, for a given. So what we need to do here is I'm going to edit this family. And then in the revision schedule, let me just double click on this and go to the revision schedule properties. And under sorting and grouping, note that it's set to sort by none. We need to have it to sort by something so that way it populates like any other schedule and it's sorted. Uh, uh, so I'll go ahead and do revision number. I suppose itemize every instance might do the same thing. Maybe not, not sure. But uh, anyway, this will take care of the problem. I'll just go ahead and sort by revision number, load it back into the project and we'll overwrite the ex existing version there and now everything's populating as it should if I continue to add more of these and associate them with the same or different revisions our title block should populate properly